Okay, so quick recap. Uh, you probably seen the last episode. Disney got his chocobo back. I uh, there was a culling. They basically went and like killed all the the bears in this little area. I was actually kind of upset about it. Um, they went and killed all the bears in the church. That's what it was. Yes. Um, now that that part is done, let's go ahead and go back to the um. Yeah, let's go back to the place. I also. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, here we go. Well, let's go find Gav. Hey, what's up, Joe? Back by now. Probably, probably. I hear there's trouble. Ew. Ah, Clive, <laughs> I've missed that scowl. Where's my report? What, no kind words for your old pal Gav? <laughs> if it's kind words you're after, you're fishing in the wrong barrel. Now sit down, you fool. So, you remember how quick the Empire was to occupy the Dominion after the fall of Drake's head? And how pissed off all the other nations were that they didn't think to do it first. Half a century of independence gone at the whim of a madman. So much for their bloody treaty. Clearly the promise of unblighted land and the world's supply of crystals was too much for his radiance to resist. <sighs> and now the Republic's finally decided to follow suit using liberation as an excuse to declare war on Sambrek. Lined up right outside the Dominion's gates as we speak, looking to starve the Imperials into submission. And now all eyes are on the Strait of Ortha. While the two nations beat their shields, the rest sharpen their daggers, ready to set upon the war-weary victor. They'll never see us coming. It's time we moved on the Mother Crystals. Four Mother Crystals remain in Storm and Ash. Drake's Breath, near Iron Home. Drake's Fang, in Dalmechia. Drake's Spine, in Walud. And Drake's Tail, here in the Crystalline Dominion. Drizzy. With the bulk of the Republican army marching to Twinsight, Drake's fang will be left exposed. That is exactly the move Cuckoo would anticipate. And if there is anything these past five years have taught us, is that he loves his traps. There is one place, however, where nobody will be expecting us to go. Drake's breath. A shitload of sea between us and it, and I've never been much of a swimmer. I have an acquaintance in Port is older who may be able to help. Who's that then? My uncle, Byron Rosfield. Lord Byron Rosfield of the Seven High Houses, the trade magnate with holdings in over a hundred cities. Wait, Rosfield. And you're a Rosfield, of course. My uncle's name gave him his start in the world, but it was his acumen which earned him his fortune. Along with a handsome fleet of ships. Well, it's settled then. <laughs> what are we waiting for? Eh? Alright, cool. Quick rundown. Mother Crystal's bad, draining the energy from the world. Indeed. Indeed. Uh, 
on top of that, Mother Crystal's bad when destroying the energy of the world. We destroy Mother Crystals, we save the world. Stop people from getting sick. But if we destroy the Mother Crystals, basically only people who can fuck with magic are the bears. Putting bears in a shitty situation. Done. Do you think it was wise to leave, Gav? He didn't seem pleased. I needed his eyes and nose in Dalmechia. I'm not about to let Kupka take us unawares. Besides, he has a knack for that sort of thing. That he does. And wasn't it Sid who said that matters such as these are best left to dominance? Especially should one of his beloved opportunities to grow and change present itself. <laughs> I always knew that I would return one day. Return to Ironhome. For what? After learning the truth, you were given the chance to face your past. If I am to continue at your side, I must do the same. face it together then to the end come on all right how far do you think your mother's reach extends <clears throat> will we find the same tragedy in the south as we did at Martha's rest more than likely which is why we should hurry. There are still many settlements between here and Port Isolde. We visit as many as we can and hear their stories. Starting with the village of Amber. Alright, so quick recap. She was stolen by the Iron Hole, if y'all don't remember, earlier on in the game. And they forced her to use her dominant abilities to fight for them because, you know, having a dominant is basically like having a nuke in this day and age. Here we go! Yeesh. I still have no fucking clue what to do with Sid's abilities. Rest in peace, Sid. But... His abilities, like, they don't really do anything. See, like, Ifrit's abilities hit hard than the motherfucker. Like, them shits go off. Uh... But, yeah, no, nah, Sid's abilities is, is, is whack. Not whack, but they just don't really do it. I really feel bad because I bad mouthed Sid the entire time when he was playing with me, but now I'm like, oh, Sid's dead. And now here I am bad mouthing his abilities. That's new. Yeah, yeah. Nah, nah, you screaming now, but nobody told you to get buck. I was gonna leave you alone like the mother chocobos. You saw I didn't fuck them up. Oh, I forgot. We, speaking of chocobos, what's up? Look at this. Look at my little chocobo here. This is where I should be on. Should be on this motherfucker. Look at that bow. Oh, is it, uh, I forgot about that. Look at that. Look, 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 look at this. See, I'm over here walking on foot like normal. I should have caught my goddamn chocobo. Mockery of justice is what it is. Lord Elwyn would never have stood for this. Quiet, you! 
Now they were loyalists. Jill, look. Rosaria must be cleansed of the stain which befouls her, that she might rise once again from the ashes to welcome a new dawn. It <laughs> would be a pity to make examples of you all for the transgressions of but a handful. Of course, your lordship. You shall have our full cooperation. Business could the Black Shields have in a village this small? There's barely room to hide a bearer. Then they must be here for something else. You fancy the Black Shields was like a, a thing in, in Rosaria, and these guys have preferred it. And basically, the Black Shields are like bearer hunters in different cities, and they're the ones who did the culling of the last thing, which was ass. Ooh, merchant. Welcome, stranger. The merchants went and got shit on them. Cool. Are you well? Alright. Youth, speak to me. Excuse me, but what was all that about earlier? You haven't heard? Someone's been stirring up trouble. There have been attacks on the garrison, supplies stolen. They even say a black shield was murdered. The Empire wants answers, and what the Empire wants, Empire gets. Don't they just... Keep your ears open, eh? The Black Shields will pay good coin for information on the culprits. You'd have to be dull so, as a sack so. of stones to think you could take on the Empire. What with their hundred full legions? Hundred? I heard it were a thousand. This is the next one. Nah, this is ass. So y'all basically uh, are snip, ready to snitch for some coin. There was a time my husband might have stood up to those men. Mm. Oh, back then, he wouldn't have needed to. Oh, so that man's pussy too. Solid. Okay. Oop, steel silk. We're going hunting for outlaws. Oh, so. Two more left to join the garrison this very morning. Sheesh. You seen him, didn't you? I'm sorry. The Black Shields. Just now. You seen him, didn't you? At least I think there was a Black Shields. Can't say I ever saw one before. Was this the first time they visited the village? Well, what do you think? Amber's the arsender nowhere. And they thought we might be harboring firebrands. Huh. If only we were. I might have turned him in and become a Black Shield myself. You don't think these firebrands the Empire is looking for could be us, do you? I don't know. But we need to find out. So this whole town is basically turning trick. Like, y'all just gonna give everybody up? Like, hey, I wanna be a black shield. I wanna do sick, disgusting shit and put up people out of their homes and kill people for no random reason, but aside from the fact that they're bearers and branded. Cool. Greetings, friend. We are travelers. I know that. What do you want? We couldn't help noticing those Imperial soldiers who were here earlier. Don't you go telling these strangers a thing. I speak for the people of this village, and we have nothing more to say to you. You are to leave Amber and never come back. May I at least ask why? I don't know who you are or what brings you here, but your presence puts us all in grave danger. The Empire is a harsh master. Its demands are great, and it's just as swift. But as long as we keep our heads down and pay our tributes, we are left alone. Some might call it submission. But if it will spare my people the Vicerine's wrath, then I will gladly submit. This village will not become another East Pole. Then we shall be on our way. These people live with a knife to their throat. In the mistaken belief that if they cooperate, my mother will show them mercy. Obedience bought with fear. 
Are you all right? Sorry, I... It's nothing. We still don't know who the Black Shields are looking for. Well, whoever they are, the Imperials deem them worth pursuing to the back of beyond. But other than Martha, who else in Rosari would have the courage to stand against the Empire? A new ally would certainly be welcome. Can we find them before the Imperials do? Perhaps the next village will yield more answers. Perhaps. Yeah, so... This is sad. Take us through the mountains. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And directly into the path of whoever or whatever lurks here. So it's sad because the, the village thinks that they could just sit there and be like, Oh, you know, we pay our taxes and dues. What the fuck is that? Um, then we would be good, but regardless of what the villagers do, they're fucked. Ever since the Apollo tree, we've seen more and more of these echoes. Who do you think is waking them? The mother crystals collapse? I have an idea. If I'm going to like it. I'm still kind of confused because uh, those things are outside now, and I know this definitely ruins that I can still access elsewhere. Black Shields. My mother's men. Be safe. There should be a way to fly off that horse, though. Nice try. Can't y'all see him in the middle of some shit? Nah, I don't get out. You were told to stay in your homes. The Black Shields. You know who we are. And still, you would bear your steel. Why then? We owe you our thanks. You have saved us the trouble of an interrogation. To dwell in darkness, that we may purge the night and welcome lasting dawn. On these, our swords we swear. Say that again. Alright, so first things first. Kill the magic guy. Sorry, brother. No reviving, no healing. Yeah, one shot's gonna hurt me a lot. Yeah, no, no, no. Get your black shield on. I thought y'all was nice. Ah, you saved us the interrogation. Interrogate. 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 No, come back. Interrogate. Oop. I had to pull out the map on you because I'm about to whoop your ass. Oh, hey, hey, all right. You guys need to. Cool. You guys need to. This dude. Oh, not my shorty, no. 
ya. Tell me what I want, and the end will be swift. Who are you looking for? <sighs> Why, you. We come bearing a message. Your friends have been found. The branded you freed from our camps. <sighs> they await you in Ordeal. Guardians of the Flame. <laughs> Those are Old Hill's gates. Then we hurry. That nigga definitely did not die swiftly. He sounded like he choked on his shit. Pause. was my mother's doing. But why? Why would anyone... I don't know. I never truly understood her. But this... Oh, Clive. We should go. Yes. We can't leave them here like this. We won't. But if the Black Shields have made it this far south, they may already be in Port Isolde. That's the main gate. And it looks like we're not the only ones hoping to get in. What was that? Let us pass! My children are starving! Have mercy! Voice rinse dogs, they are! You can't ignore us forever! Let in or we'll die on your doorstep! Better out there than in here! Oh, get enough for you! Chinless bastards! Those crystals belong to us all! I said, where were you, filth? Back to your stars! I'll cut you down where you stand! Just try it! No chance of slipping through unnoticed. We'll need to find another way in. I thought we might be able to reason with the guards. Or at least bribe them. I suspect everyone in that crowd thought the same. Was that the only way in? Officially, yes. Strictly speaking, no. My uncle once told me that the nobles had tunnels built, so that they could visit town without having to walk amongst the rabble. The Lazarus. We'll find our way into the city there. 
If you're sure. And the entire place looked abandoned. Do you think it's safe? As long as it is abandoned. The good news is, we haven't seen a single black shield since Old Hill. Maybe they found who they were looking for. Hmm... Debating. Debating on whether I should just be like, fuck it. I got a few more minutes till I gotta actually save. It's luster. Not abandoned then. Oi, visitors! Apologies. We'll show ourselves out. Damn it. I'm pretty sure they're oh they're bandits. Oh, here I am thinking y'all nice town folk. I'm like, I don't want to kill the nice town folk. Fuck bandits though, I just give two shits. Hey dog, see this dude trying to sneak <laughs> trying to sneak me, but my dog's right there, boy. I ain't gonna use magic to kill y'all. I'm just gonna try to put y'all out like that. Who's this asshole? Yeah, see, I'm gonna let Jill fuck you up. It's over. I've only ever seen one man fight like that. And he's long dead. Then perhaps it's time you joined him. The blessing of the Phoenix. It can't be. I was there when you died. Huh? Is that my nigga Wade? Uh, I knew not whom I addressed. You have naught to fear from us. Founder, it really is you. It is. So wait. Wait, my guy! Can speak inside. As soon as this cutscene is over, I am definitely calling it a night. And those who wouldn't bend the knee? We left before the Empire could make examples of us, though we didn't go far. And we banded together to form the Guardians of the Flame soon after. Alas, there is only so much a handful of aging shields can do against the might of an empire. You look exactly the same, bro. But we've seen to it that their stay has been anything but pleasant. Of late, though, we've had our hands full just trying to keep the Duchy's few remaining bearers out of the Imperial's clutches. The Cullings. We saw what happened in Old Hill. Aye, the foul work of the Black Shields and their mistress. You mean my mother? But it doesn't make sense. Even knowing what I know about her. Her hatred for bearers was no secret, but... She wouldn't have been ignorant of their value to the realm. No offense, my lord. 
But in case you haven't noticed, the Lady Annabella couldn't care less about the realm. She barely even cares for her own home. That much has been plain since the slaughter at Eastpool. And, since granting the Holy Emperor a new heir, her obsession with bearers only seems to have grown. As to why, I don't know. Maybe she can't bear the thought of anyone having the power to challenge her beloved son. Her son. So wait, the Black Shields are broken camp. They march in full force for Buick Bridge. Then so do we. Make ready. This is their main host. If we remove the head, perhaps... Perhaps we can prevent what happened at the docks from happening somewhere else. If I do nothing, then the blood of their next victims will be on my hands. Yours and ours. We too have witnessed the crimes these men who dare call themselves shields have committed in my mother's name. It cannot be allowed to continue. We must put a stop to this madness. We must. So let us go with you. For the good of Rosaria. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Very well. If that is your wish, I would be honored to serve at your side. And we at yours. So, Wade, let us do our duty. With pleasure, my lord. I imagine this endeavor will require more than just our wits. Then let's hope Sir Wade has a good quartermaster. All right, well, shit. We got back with Wade. Wade's back in our good graces, you feel me? Um, fuck all that other shit. I'm gonna go ahead and save now. Thank y'all for tuning in, and I'll see y'all next episode.